Today, I am going to be letting my hamster pick my outfits. It is later that night and we have a little rhino here and we are going to be placing him in and this- <gasps> Yes! Green shirt, purple pants. Yes, I do you all of the time. I like to come on, come on, come on. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video is really, really exciting for me. It is going to be a mesh between two different types of videos on my channel. I feel like I post half lifestyle, half style videos, and half hamster care and hamster related videos. And today's is actually a mesh of both of those. Today, I am going to be letting my hamster pick my outfits. Yeah. It's gonna be interesting and I can't wait to get started. But before I do, I do just want to mention my sponsor for this video. Yes, you guys heard that right, sponsor. Your girl got a sponsor, let's go. This is kind of like amazing because I was just talking in my last video about how smaller YouTubers can also get sponsors. This is just an example of that. The brand that is sponsoring me today is a New York based jewelry brand called Ana Luisa. So if you guys have Snapchat, you've probably seen them before maybe. They have really, really, really cute jewelry. I'm actually wearing some pieces right now and I'm gonna show you guys. So I'm wearing the Vita necklace. It is just like this little diamond V on this really cute little thin gold chain. It's really cute and I feel like this piece personally can be layered with so many different things. It's so small and cute that you can like wear this with anything and it's not too much because I feel like a lot of jewelry these days is kind of bulky. And then we have these earrings. They look like this and they are these Suzanne earrings and they are like little diamond huggies. These two pieces personally just go super well together. I picked both of them out and I did not even realize like how amazing they would look together because they're both like gold and diamond. Recently, I've actually really been getting into smaller jewelry, just pieces that I can wear every day. So that's more about the pieces, but more about the brand is they are a really sustainable brand. They actually have a goal to be carbon neutral by the end of 2020, which I think is amazing. I don't know if you guys know this, but I am a big climate activist, you would say. I would like to be kind of having a bigger role in that, but I definitely support sustainability in a company. They actually use 100% recycled gold materials, which is amazing. Their prices are also affordable because they start at just $39 and then they go up to some more higher end prices. So this was actually $79 and these were $55, I believe. I could be wrong though. And you might be thinking, well, that is kind of expensive, but you really are paying for a great product. I actually used to buy a lot of my jewelry from just like Claire's, Walmart, Target, H&M. Oh my gosh. At first I thought they were so cute and I was going to wear them every day, but as I wore them continually, they just turned brown and several times I have been left with brown rims in my ears because of the jewelry that I'm wearing. It's just not good quality. So I am so happy that I have this jewelry now. If you guys are interested in looking at or buying any of this jewelry, I would definitely recommend it. Go down below into the description and use my code naturally 10 to get 10% off and I promise you will not regret it like everyone's gonna be commenting being like where that jewelry where phone girl, girl? Like, like I want that you know what I mean so yeah definitely go and check Ana Luisa out Another thing that I just thought I would mention really quick because it just kind of came to mind was that the fact that they are really reaching out to smaller YouTubers like myself shows that they genuinely find interest in our content and they're genuinely interested in the people that they reach out to and it's not all about the number of clicks that they get to their site or something. So I just thought I'd throw that out there. So they're a really genuine brand and I really support them and enjoy working with them. Okay, so with that being said, let's go ahead and get into the main video, which is my hamster picks my outfits for a week. I'm sure you guys are like, 
how is her hamster going to be picking out her outfits? Like what? So pretty much what I did is I cut out little miniature shirts. We have a pink shirt, we have a white shirt, we have a purple shirt. We have a black shirt, a blue shirt, and what I'm going to be doing is tonight, once Rhino is awake, I'm going to be laying these out on the ground, and we're just going to see whichever one he goes to first is the first shirt I'm going to wear next week. And we have the same thing with pants. So we have some black pants, some blue pants, we have some bl blue shorts, so I don't have like crazy colored pants. So I was just like, we'll have some blue pants. We have some blue shorts, purple skirt, and we have a blue skirt. Same thing with these. I'm just gonna be laying them out and whichever one Rhino goes to, I'll be matching them together. So these little cutout shirts and pants, they actually correlate to clothes that I have in my dresser and I'll make an outfit out of them. For all of the outfits, I am going to be wearing my Ana Luisa jewelry because like why not it's gonna go with everything it's just gonna add a really cute touch all right you guys so it is later that night and we have a little rhino here and we are going to be placing him in and discovering which one he chooses so as you guys can see over here we have the six different pants i decided to add some white pants just because why not Oh my gosh, I just put this in there um, just because I have some treats. I'm gonna put some treats actually on it. See which one he goes to. Oh, okay, well he went to the black one first. So that means I'm gonna be wearing the black ones tomorrow. Anyway, <laughs> this is not... Maybe we should put them in there before he... Yeah, um, we're just gonna wait until he picks the next seeds. Yeah, anyway, so he just picked the black and then the blue pants. So it looks like I'll be wearing jeans for the next two days. Oh, the blue, the blue skirt. Oh, the white. I mean, yeah, he's kind of next to the white. So we'll have to see. He has two more options, the purple skirt or the blue shorts. I really want to wear the purple skirt, so I'm hoping he goes to that one next. Yes! Yay! Okay, so he finally picked all of them. Alright, so now I'm gonna go get the shirts. So we're only doing it for five days, so um, I guess it looks like I'm not wearing any blue shorts next week. Okay, alright, so we just took out all of the shorts and pants that I'm wearing, and now it's time for him to pick the shirts. I, I wasn't filming, but he went to the black shirt first. I'm hoping he doesn't just like go straight down the line and will he go to blue next? He did not eat the blue, so we will not consider that going to the blue. Oh, 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 oh he oh. picked that thing up. Purple. purple. He picked the purple. Okay, so it's black, purple. We'll take those out. I'm gonna consider that a blue. He picked the blue. So he's currently in his cage, and what we have decided to do is I just placed them in different places around the cage, and so whichever one he touches first is the next one to go. So we just need him to pick two more, and we'll be good to go. Oh, oh, is he gonna pick the pink? I have to take the wheel out. Oh, he picked the pink, yay. Oh. Then he picked the green. That's it for that part. He officially picked all of the shirts and shorts. Now it is up to me for the rest of the week to pick out the actual outfits, see how they do. I just laid out all of the outfits on my desk and this is what we have to work with for the week. Of course, I have to pick out actual pieces from my wardrobe to fit all of these requirements. So I have to pick a black shirt and black pants tomorrow, a purple shirt and blue pants, a blue shirt, blue skirt, pink shirt, white pants, green shirt, purple pants. This is like exactly what I did not want to happen, which was have like one color be with another same color. But I'm hoping that since there'll be like different shades, I will have like different colored accessories and things like that. I can kind of 
oomph it up a little bit. So we'll see how this goes. Hey guys, so it's the next day and I just finished getting ready in my black on black outfit because that's what Rhino picked out for me to wear as my first outfit. Um, so I'm just gonna show you guys it. So first we have this shirt. It has like this really cute like little ruffle on the top. It's like an off the shoulder type shirt. It's kind of like scrunched at the sleeve and it's kind of like cropped too, which is kind of nice. And then I have these pants. They look like this. I actually got these from H&M a while ago and actually cut the rips myself. And it has like this little pocket right here. I don't know if you guys can see it, if it kind of like blends in with the black, but they're supposed to kind of be like cargo pants. But since I had to do the black on black, I was like, you know what? I think this looks pretty cute and I haven't worn this shirt in a while as well. Unfortunately, I do have a lot of schoolwork to do today, so I should probably get to that. And of course, the jewelry is just the Ana Luisa jewelry I showed you guys at the beginning of the video. Literally like my new favorite jewelry, like I'm not even kidding you. It goes with like every outfit perfectly, so yeah. getting ready and kind of picking out my outfit and we have on this purple sweater I just kind of had it buttoned but I showed this to you guys a while ago in my back to school clothing haul and I love it because it's purple and today I had to wear a purple shirt or like a purple top with blue bottoms just kind of wearing it over this white crop top that I have on and I think that it looks really nice and I actually got this from the thrift store a while ago the shirt is from Aeropostale, and the jeans, these are from Old Navy. They just look like this. They have like these really awesome rips. And now I need to go put on my jewelry because I haven't put on e any earrings or any necklaces on yet. So that's what we're gonna do. I know this is so random, but um, I have an English project and it's not really a project, it's kind of like an activity where we have to um, make memes for our vocab words. And so I made this meme and I wanted to show it you guys. One of the words we had to use was pretentious. It says, I'm not being pretentious, you're being pretentious. And it has a cat. Isn't that so funny? Ha ha, am I right? So today is day three of my hamster picks my outfits and today was the blue on blue day so I have to wear a blue shirt which is this one. I admit it is kind of purpley. For the sake of this video we're just gonna say that it's close enough to blue. I feel like it's like right in the middle. So I have to wear this blue shirt with a blue skirt. Now I originally had an idea of what blue skirt I wanted to wear 
but that skirt was just not working for me today so I decided to just wear a basic blue denim skirt looks like this I got this from H&M a while ago and the top is from Air Apostle. So I feel like the outfit in general is like very fall vibes. I definitely would not normally like put these two pieces together, but I do like how like the skirt is kind of like high-waisted and since the shirt is a little cropped, they kind of hit like right at the perfect spot. And then of course we have the jewelry, just simple necklace, simple earrings i love them so as you guys can probably already tell i have not actually like gotten ready a whole lot today i have just um threw on this outfit and so i'm gonna go do a time lapse of me getting ready and like washing my face doing my makeup and all of that so that's what we're gonna do <laughs> done pretty good just pretty natural honestly all i did was like a little bit of eyeliner eyeshadow mascara and like a tiny little bit of um brow powder so yeah that's pretty much like my basic everyday makeup look so back to the outfit though because that's like the most important thing today is actually a very busy day for me i'm actually getting my driver's license which i'm so excited about because i feel like i'm going to be able to drive so many more places and like go places that i would just like not be able to go i mean like not anywhere bad like i just mean like going driving to the beach or something or going to the movies just being able to drive myself places without having like ask my parents and I just feel like it's gonna be really fun and I also have a biology test that I have to take it's gonna be online obviously so I have like a bunch of stuff to do I'm gonna go do that but I'll definitely vlog at least a little bit today um, I'm kind of vibing with my outfit I feel like it's pretty cute so Today, I was about to like introduce today, but it's the end of today, the end of day three. And I just got back from youth group about like 30 minutes ago. I'm still sporting my outfit. I'm honestly kind of feeling it now. Like this morning, I was like unsure. I was like, I don't, I don't know about this outfit, but honestly, I kind of like it. But I Ew, I know literally my room is so messy in all of these clips. I'm so embarrassed. I'm so sorry. I am going to clean my room, I swear. I literally spilled like three things on this today. I hope this shirt doesn't stay stained and this will come out in the wash, but I have to go um, get unready for bed, play with Rhino, do some last minute schoolwork. So I have quite a bit to do. I'll see you guys tomorrow for day four of my hamster picks my outfits. Oh, summer. It sounds great. It is day number four of my hamster picks my outfit. Today is the pink shirt, white pants day. Now, today, honestly, is just kind of like an, a stay at home day. Like, I'm not going out at all today. Needless to say, I did not try super hard with my outfit today. Literally, just have this basic pink tee of some like white pants or white ish pants. They're kind of tan, but. They look white enough, I feel like. They're very comfortable, so honestly, I have just been doing schoolwork for like the entire day, and it has not been very fun at all. So I just kind of wanted to feel kind of cozy and just chill. That's kind of how my day is going. Honestly, don't know if I'm gonna have anything to film today. So if I don't, I'm sorry, but if I do, let's go. Hey guys. So today is day number five of my hamster picks my outfits. 
today my outfit is definitely interesting i definitely wanted to like go all out with this outfit because yesterday's outfit was definitely a little lacking so we just have like some hoops and um some of the anna louise's little diamond hoops and this is the outfit um so i had to do a green shirt and a purple skirt now that's definitely not something that i would like normally choose to wear like this is not something i would be like oh i'm gonna go grab this green shirt grab this purple skirt like they don't necessarily clash but i feel like with my hair being like so like big and frizzy today and like this green shirt i feel like i should be in like some 70s movie or something is that just me am i like getting my decades wrong i am hopefully going to be trying to go to the beach today so i'm hoping i can get like some really cute montage pictures or something but i got this skirt when i went back to school shopping and i literally have not even worn it at all yet so i'm glad i finally get to wear it this shirt i bought at like the beginning of the summer so <laughs> I just drove yeah. for the first time all by myself. Um, first we, time since we have our licenses. I know, because we got our licenses two days ago, as you guys saw. And I, I drove to the beach, so we're at the beach and my friend's coming. So I'm not sure exactly where she is, but she's on her way. And we're going to go take some pictures. Can we stay just vibe. Like an adulting now? Yeah, we're, we're adulting, guys. We're grown up. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, that is pretty much it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I really liked how this video was kind of incorporating like the two sides of my channel that I talked about, like this lifestyle part and then like the hamster part. I liked how I could like kind of like intertwine them in this video. So if you did like this, definitely like it and tell me down below if I should do like more of these type of videos, um, more like where her Rhino will like pick out my outfits or something, or I could even like wear it to school and yeah, I don't know. So. I hope you guys enjoyed and liked the outfits that I picked out. Definitely go check out Anna Luisa if you liked any of the jewelry that you guys saw in this video. I seriously, like, I'm not just saying this, but this is like my new favorite jewelry. I've been wearing it for the week straight and it just goes with everything so perfectly. It's just so simple. It's just a great brand, like I talked about at the beginning. I have a link down below and I do have a code for 10% off, naturally 10 10% off at checkout and you will not regret it. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. You love